Hey guys and welcome to my channel. If you're new, my name is Sarah. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how I do my everyday makeup look. Um, it's going to be a very simple quick video, so no need for a fancy intro. So if you're interested, just keep on watching. So usually for my everyday makeup, I don't have time to blend foundation. So what I like to do is prep my face to have like the nicest base possible without foundation. So what I did is I used a toner, then I did my eye cream and my moisturizer and now i'm going to be applying my primer and i'm using the professional from benefit i'm only taking a little bit warming up on my fingers and applying it on the bridge of my nose and my cheeks Alright, so when that's done, what I like to do is move on to contouring. So I'm using the NYX Wonder Stick today in the shade 04 Universal. And I'm going to be using the dark side. And I'm just going to contour my cheeks and my nose. Alright, so now that I've applied my contour, I'm going to move on to concealer and for that I want the best coverage because I'm not doing foundation today as I said previously. So for that I'm going to use my favorite combo which is the Bare Mineral Bare Skin and the Tarte Shape Tape um, Concealer in the shade Light Sand and the Bare Minerals is in the shade Medium Golden. So the reason I combine these two is because the Shape Tape gives me better coverage but it's not the right shade, it's a little bit... Um, light and it's also a little bit dry like the consistency i just feel like it's a little dry so that's why i really like combining the two of them all right and now i'm just gonna blend with my wet beauty blender I also tap the excess product on my eyelids, that way I don't have to use too much of a, like, a base later on. And now I'm going to take some more of my Bare Mineral Concealer and I'm just going to put a little bit on the bridge of my nose. Just to clean up that contour some more. Alright, so now I'm going to be setting my under eye and for that I'm going to be using my NYX Banana Powder. Um, by the way, you guys, this video is kind of going to be like a struggle, like struggling video, because I only have with me five brushes. So I know you might be thinking like, what about all of these, but all of these are dirty. So what happened is I traveled and I left all of my brushes to collect dust on my shelf. And yeah, now they are dusty and disgusting. I know for a fact that if I use these brushes, I'm going to break out like no tomorrow. So no thanks. But yeah, so I'm just applying the NYX Banana Powder under my eyes and on my lids and on my nose a little bit. Alright, so next I'm going to be doing my eyebrows and for that I'm going to be using the Catrice Cosmetics um, Brow Pencil in the shade Cool Brown. In the shade Cool Brown. So what I'm doing is I'm just brushing them in the direction I want them to have with the little spoolie that's attached. Um, this is a new brow pencil that I recently got. I'm actually going to be doing a haul about like the things that I got, so stay tuned for that. Hi right, you guys, so I am back with eyebrows. Um, all I did was fill in my eyebrows with the pencil, like outline the lines, and then to add a little bit more filling <laughs> per se, I used the bronzing from Benefit. Um, as you can tell, I've like well used this thing, I've had it forever, but I only use the powder part of it. I just patted it a little bit on my eyebrows and yeah. Oh, and obviously I cleaned the edges just a little bit, not too much, like I didn't really carve them out because 
it's my everyday makeup routine and I don't have time for that but yeah Alright, so our next step is foundation powder and today I'm going to be using the Laura Mercier one in the shade 11. Alright, so now that that's done, we're going to move on to bronzer and for bronzer, I'm using the Catrice Cosmetics Sun Glow in the shade 035 Universal Bronze. And now with the brush that I used uh, for my uh, foundation powder, I'm just blending everything. Alright, so for eyes, I'm sorry by the way, I'm doing a lot of jumping back and forth between my face and then my eyes and my eyebrows, but that's kind of just how I do my makeup, so bear with me. But for eyes, I'm going to be using the bronze palette from Kylie Cosmetics. Um, this is honestly my favorite palette to use for my everyday makeup because it just has all of the colors that I usually use. So, oops. So what I'm going to be using is this shade right here. It's this brownie orange and I think it's called Goldstone or Tiger Eye. Who knows? Probably Tiger Eye. And I'm just going to be putting this right above my crease. And for that, by the way, I'm using a fluffy blending brush from e.l.f. I think it is. Yes. Alright, and for our second shade, I'm going to be using this shade right here. It's kind of like a burnt orange that's like a little bit more reddish though. So yeah, I'm just going to apply this on my outer corner. Alright, so for our last shade, like I said, I ran out of clean makeup brushes, so I'm going to use my finger to apply this shimmery shade um, on my lid. This is kind of like a champagne shade, which I really like, it's my favorite shade of the palette. And I'm just going to put this on my lid. Hoping not to make too much of a mess. And now to make the mess a little bit less visible, I'm just going to blend everything together. Like that. Like blend the edges like into my crease. Alright, so back to the face, I'm going to be doing my highlighter now and I'm going to be using the Fenty Beauty Kilowatt in the shade Mean Money and Hustle Baby and um, because I don't have any clean brushes, I'm going to be using this foundation brush um, to, you know, apply my highlighter and see how that goes. So I'm, blend I'm using the two shades together, just tapping in both colors and just, yeah. Oh god, this is not a highlighter brush. This is kind of like a tips and tricks for like when your makeup brushes are dirty. So use a foundation brush for highlighter. Um, zero out of ten would recommend, but you know you gotta do what you gotta do. So to make it a little less harsh, we're gonna take our uh, brush that we used for the foundation powder and just blend it because this is so odd you guys all right and for blush i'm going to be using la palette du soleil from clarence and um yeah it's this really nice blush that has all these different shades and you just blend it together and it creates literally the nicest color ever and i'm just putting that on the apples of my cheeks and a little bit on the tip of my nose
I really like going all out with my blush, so don't mind me. <laughs> Alright, now I'm gonna set my face and for that I'm gonna use the NYX uh, Dewy Finish Setting Spray. And now we're gonna do mascara, and for mascara I'm using the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. Alright, so last but not least, I'm gonna be doing lipstick. For my everyday makeup look, I usually do a very like nude pink, something very neutral. But because it is fall and I'm obsessed with this new lipstick that I got, I'm gonna be using it. So it's the NYX Lingerie Push Up um, Lipstick. It's a matte and it's in the shade Seduction. And this is literally my favorite thing ever lately. It has this like mint cooling effect that's supposed to like plump up your lips and I don't really care for it but this shade is like gorgeous. And alright, that's it. I'm gonna go take my hair down and I'll be right back. Okay, she's back and better. <laughs> Alright you guys, so this was it for today's video. If you enjoyed it, make sure you click the like button to show me your support. And if you enjoyed spending time with me, make sure you click subscribe so you can see more of me. And also make sure you click the bell so you can get notified every time I upload. And yeah, this was it. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!